Hello friends, today's question, two block of masses 0.9 kg and 1.9 kg are suspended from a rigid support S by two inextensible wires each of length 1 meter. See figure, the upper wire has negligible mass and the lower wire has a uniform mass of 0.2 kg per meter. The whole system of blocks, wires and support have an upward acceleration of 0.2 meter per second squared. The acceleration due to gravity is 9.8 meter per second squared. So this is a figure and we are supposed to find out two things. Find the tension at the midpoint of the lower wire and part B, find the tension at the midpoint of the upper wire. So in this case, it is given that the lower wire has a mass per unit length as 0.2 and the upper wire is massless okay and the entire system is moving upward with the acceleration of 0.2 meter per second square and the length of each wire is given as 1 meter so let us suppose this is the midpoint and here the tension is given as T1 and this is the midpoint of upper wire here tension is given as T2 total length of upper wire is 1 meter and of the lower wire is also 1 meter therefore we can say that this distance will be 0.5 meter okay. and this will be also equal to 0.5 meter so let us consider case A the tension at the midpoint of the lower wire part A tension at the midpoint of the lower wire let us post it is in T1 and it is also said that the entire system is moving upward with the acceleration of A and that is given as 0 0.2 meter per second square Let us redraw this diagram here. Same two. Let us suppose this is M one, and this is point T one at a distance of point five meter moving upward with the acceleration of A. So here, the downward direction we are going to have for T1, M1G, that is the mass and the mass for the length 0.5 meter sorry the force for the mass uh, for the length 0.5 meter okay let us call that f 0 0.5 and this will be g okay. you can say f 0 0.5 is force on the length of the rope point five meter. So we can find out F zero point five will be equal to let's not add here G, we are going to put it here. So point five meter that is length 
and the uniform mass per meter is given as 0.2 so this will be 0.2 and multiply by g so this is our total force acting on mass m1 which is being supported by tension t1 and the entire system is moving upward with the extension a therefore for upward extension of a can write the t1 minus we are going to have m1g plus the substitute value of f.05 that is 0.5 into 0.2 multiplied by g this will be equal to m1 plus 0.5 into 0.2 and multiply by A. So here we can just adjust the equation and this will be getting as A plus G multiply by M1 plus 0.5 multiply by 0.2. Acceleration is given as 9.8 sorry acceleration given as 0 0.2 0 0.2 plus 9.8 that is G and M1 is our 9.1 1.9 rather and we get plus this is 0.5 multiplied by 0 0.2 So if you solve this, we are going to get tension T1 is equal to 20 Newton. So this is the tension at the midpoint of the lower wire. This is the tension at the midpoint of the lower wire. Similarly, we can do for part B also. Part B. Let us draw the free body diagram for it. This is M2. We have M1. And this is the midpoint, this is T2, okay, and the length is given as 1 meter, this will be also 1 meter, and the downward direction, we are going to have m1 plus m2g and now plus rather the force because of this entire length 1 meter so let us call that f1 so we can say tension at the midpoint of the upper wire is T2 and F1 is the force on the length of the rope which is 1 meter. So we can calculate F1. F1 mass per unit length is given as 0 0.2 multiply 1 and multiply by g and the entire system is moving once again with the acceleration of a in upward direction so you can say for upward acceleration of a for upward acceleration of a 
equation of a we can write the equation as t2 minus we have m1 plus m2 substitute value of f1 plus 0 0.2 multiply 1 g is equal to m1 plus m2 plus 0 0.2 multiplied by 1 and it is moving with the same acceleration multiplied by a therefore we can write that t2 is equal to this will be equal to m1 plus m2 plus 0 0.2 multiplied by 1 and a plus g we substitute the values t2 it is given as 2.9 plus 1.9 plus 0.2 into 1 a is given as 0.2 and g is 9.8 So if we solve this, we get T2 is equal to 50 Newton. So for this, value of tension, sorry, this is the value of the tension, value of tension at midpoint of the upper wire okay. so this completes the question thank you